Local chefs in Wichita are competing for who has the best vegan dish in town. And this competition runs through June. This morning, KSN's Mally Jones is live at Envision Bistro to tell us how you can get in on the fun. Good morning, Mally. Hey guys, good morning. Well, this month people can go to any of the participating restaurants and then they can vote for their favorite dish among those restaurants. And this is the first time this challenge has been here in Wichita. And I have Sarah Hyden here with me this morning. And Sarah, this has a little bit of a backstory. Can you tell us how this started? Yeah, so it started in 2010 in North Carolina. Um, someone put on a vegan chef challenge as a fun way for chefs to create more vegan options in their area. And the nonprofit Vegan Outreach thought it was an amazing idea. It was super successful, so they started doing it nationwide. And the local Wichita Chef Challenge is sponsored by the Spice Merchant and Infinity Art Glass. And it has a lot of local chefs competing with coming out with new vegan specials. Yeah, very cool, very unique for sure. And coming up here in 30 minutes, we have Keegan back there. He's going to be making us one of the dishes. We're going to be talking to him about participating and what he's making for us. Eddie, Alexis? I'm excited to see what that dish will look like. I want to taste it. I feel like <laughs> we always have these dishes that are tons of meat and I don't eat meat and now you're there, Mally, so I feel like you got to bring me back a little taste. <laughs> Maybe if you're nice. <laughs> Thank you, Mally. Who has the best vegan dish in Wichita is up for debate. Mm -hmm. Nearly 20 chefs are battling it out for the title. KSN's Mally Jones is live at Envision Bistro. Good morning, Mally. Hey guys, good morning. Well, this is all a part of the Vegan Chef Challenge, and I have Keegan back here cooking up a dish for us. It's been sizzling the last couple of minutes. I've just been standing here listening and smelling. Keegan, tell us what you're making here. Today we're making a vegan corn curry dish. It's a uh, street noodle style. It's got a corn stock, corn curry, uh, fresh red pepper, shallots, Finished with uh, pickled grilled corn, some fresh local herbs, chili crisp, and some uh, crispy shallots. Wow, okay, very colorful. I love, I love what, what we've got going on over here. And Keegan, why did you guys want to participate in this challenge? I think it's really important to participate in this challenge just to show that, uh, show the city that you can do some really great things with vegan food and plant-based food in general. You know, there seems to be kind of a hole uh, in the market for that, so we want to just make sure we're doing our part and uh, making sure that we're having great vegan options for people to come and try. Yeah. Awesome, well, super cool. Thank you, Keegan. I'm excited to try that here in just uh, 30 minutes or so, maybe an hour. I'm not sure how long we'll be able to wait, but we are gonna try that and we'll let you know how it is. And we'll tell you also how you can get involved and share your opinion here coming up soon. Eddie, Alexis. It looks so good. I can just imagine what it smells like in that kitchen, Mally. Alexis is over here saying her mouth is watering, so you got to bring us something back. Thanks, Mally. <laughs> Local chefs in Wichita are competing for who has the best vegan dish in town. And that's right. This competition runs through June, and this morning, KSN's Mally Jones is live at Envision Bistro, making us all hungry. And Mally, <laughs> you're going to talk about how people can get involved in the fun. <laughs> Yeah, well, all month long, people can go around to participating restaurants like here at Envision Bistro, try their vegan dish, then vote on their favorite. I have an example here. Keegan, the sous chef, made us this nice little dish here. Super colorful. We're going to try that here pretty soon. I can't wait. But first, I have Sarah Hyden here with me. And Sarah, this is the first time this is here in Wichita. How did this all start? So this started in about 2010 in North Carolina. They had a vegan chef challenge and it was super successful. It was a fun way to get chefs inspired to create more vegan options in the area. And it was so successful, vegan outreach uh, got in contact. They began doing this nationwide to reduce animal suffering. And they brought it to Wichita this year. Um, and we have a lot of local chefs that are competing. We have local sponsors, uh, the Spice Merchant and Infinity Art Glass and a team of local volunteers to make it happen. Nice, well it's been cool to hear some of the creative ways that chefs are making some stuff a little bit different than they normally would. We're going to try that dish coming up soon and talk to the chef about why they decided to get involved coming up in 30 minutes. Eddie, Alexis. I feel Mally has stronger patience than us because I feel we would have already taken some bites. Oh, several. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mally. Seeing an organization meet that need is incredible. <laughs> Or we are going to talk food right now, and we're talking about who has the best vegan dishes in Wichita. It's all up for debate. Nearly 20 chefs are battling it out for the title. KSN's Mally Jones is live at Envision Bistro. Good morning, Mally. 
Hey, good morning. Well, this is all a part of the Vegan Chef Challenge, and Envision Bistro here is one of the people, one of the restaurants that is participating in the Vegan Chef Challenge, and people can go and vote for which dish they think they like the best. And so I have Keegan here with me, and Keegan, tell me what you've been making for us this morning. So today we've been making this vegan corn curry street noodle. It's uh, pad thai noodles tossed with our uh, house-made yellow corn curry. It has pickled grilled corn, crispy shallots, red bell peppers, and fresh local herbs from ICT Urban Greens. Okay, and we're gonna give it a shot here. And they said, do you want chopsticks or a fork? I said, live television, please give me a fork. <laughs> Let's give it a shot. I don't think I've ever tried a vegan dish before, so this I think is my first time. And while I get my noodles situated here, can you tell us why you decided to participate in this? Absolutely, yeah, I thought it was very important for us to participate in an event like this, just to kind of showcase that there are some really great and creative uh, vegan plant-based options in the city, kind of hoping to fill that void a little bit and then also show the students that, you know, there's something to be said about great vegan food here. Awesome, super creative. Okay, I have my noodles situated. Let's give it a shot. Mm-hmm, that's good stuff. Thank you. That's good stuff, Thank Keegan. <laughs> All right. We have more details on KSN.com. Eddie and Alexis, back to you. And Melly, you be proud of yourself. People like to uh, talk about me because I don't use chopsticks correctly, and I don't care. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to use them. <laughs> Do you? <laughs> All right, Melly, thank you.